What is your name? Nicholas Laufman. What delegation are you from? I'm from the Bear Glass delegation. And how many years have you been in the egg? This is my fourth year in the egg. Uh, can you give me a quick explanation of your bill? Uh, what my bill is essentially doing is it's taking the entire uh, high, public high school education system right now and it's revamping it in a way that's more progressive, <coughs> uh, more used in you know, a, a way that's been proven uh, to be effective for preparing kids not only for college but for the real world. Awesome. All right. And what was your inspiration for this bill? Uh, I had many aspects of inspiration. Uh, the first one um, came while I was in French class one day. We were studying the French uh, education system uh, and its structure and how effective it is. And um, I really thought this would be a great way to do it uh, here in the United States. I think the United States is ready for something like that. So that came for the structure. But I also have different aspects of my bill, uh, like I'm adding uh, standards for uh, civics, economics, and personal finance. And that just came from a common sense idea. We don't, a lot, uh, I know in my school we don't learn stuff like that. Um, and uh, I just think if a class was dedicated to that in all schools, it could better, better prepare all students for the real world when they have to manage their own money uh, and survive on their own and meet ends meet on their own without a parent's help. Um, and then I also changed Common Core standards, and the inspiration for that was uh, I feel like. Well, I didn't change common core standards. I reformed them for the state, uh, and my inspiration for that was I feel common core is incomplete, and I feel like it's too um, one size fits all and needs to be more individualized. That's really cool. Uh, and what specifically, like, what number one thing makes your bill stand out from the many, many, many other education bills? Uh, number one thing is probably the length. It's the longest bill in the bill book this year, but that's not <laughs> what I want everyone to think of it as. I guess the number one thing is how progressive, how liberal it is uh, moving forward. Uh, in a world where globalization is growing every day, uh, I think an uh, education system that is, is more global and is more used around the world. I know the structure is used in Japan, France, Finland. Um, a structure that's more global is definitely something that the United you know, States could benefit from. So I think that's what really makes my most stand out. That's really good. And are there any important things that you want the viewers to know about your bill? Don't be intimidated by the lake. If you're debating it, uh, which uh, if you're in the Senate and you're debating it the first time, don't be intimidated by the lake. Uh, it's, it's a pretty easy bill to understand. It's not super complicated. Um, but. If, and in debate, if you need to ask me a question, if you don't understand it, feel free to ask a question. I'm more than happy to answer it. You can find me uh, when we're not in debate, when we're uh, in recess or uh, at dinner or lunch. Just come and find me and ask a question about the bill. I'd be more than happy to answer it. She asked me, son, when 